Greetings folks and welcome back to the channel. I'm your host Coco Smooth, the casual collector, and in this segment of 112 scale military action figure sticks, I am showcasing the Top Fun Retro Toys Advanced Combat Rifle ACR set. Uh, one with the M stock and the other with the fixed stock suppressed. Now, in desert, of course. Desert. These are uh, the full disclaimer, this is not one of the things that I ordered. This is strictly one of those things that uh top fun had sent my way to to review for you know i guess to to, to shed some light on you know how it looks and all that other stuff now in one of my previous videos i did already buy acrs except they were the tan ones you know um i got like multiples but deep inside i always wanted it to be painted like this so i'm familiar with the craft the way it looks everything it looks this is exactly what it looks like the first time around except this time this paint job the desert paint job definitely uh brings new life to it um i will i will show you guys the difference so y'all understand what i'm talking about So here are the ones that I got last time. Um, as you can see, the color is definitely different, right? Suppress this one though. Ex same exact rifle with the M stock. Um, nothing, nothing bad about it. It's, it's, it, it, it looks like an ACR and everything. It's just, guys, y'all know me. Y'all already know. Y'all gotta go this way or, or 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 not at all for me. It's either desert or pa you know painted or th this this was cool in the beginning when I was used to GI Joe stock weapons looking like this. You know what I mean? But as my you know as new product comes in and I'm a I become accustomed to stuff. It, it it's the the I don't see these things the same way that I see this. <laughs> what I see is a unfinished product now instead of this, which is a complete product now that they have pros painting in, in, in top fun. So, you know, if, if I had to retroactively do this again, yes, I definitely want all of these to be in desert or some, some other paint job kind of fashion, right? Uh, this was the this is the that same rifle except this time it's not suppressed and I was in love with the M stock. Um, but he did in you know he probably noticed well why don't you show some love to the to the to the fixed stock and he did send me a fixed stock one with the you know suppressor. So yeah, um, I was like okay well cool. It's, it, it looks good. It looks like an AC, you know, an ACR. Then you start seeing things like this, the fixed stock one. And you're like, in desert. <laughs> you're like, yeah. Um, let me know, folks. Which would you guys rather have? I mean, this, this only makes sense for the people who, in my opinion, who absolutely love the stock look or have their own paint job skills and are willing to get this on the cheap mode so that they can paint it themselves. And, and I'm hoping that when they paint it, it looks the way they're able to paint with this level of skill. You know what I'm saying? You can see the textures on that with the wash that they did. It, this, you know, while it, it, it's there and exists, it's it's not really brought up when it's stuck like this. This this definitely brings it out. You know what I'm saying? Look, I mean, even this, something as subtle as the blue thing right there goes a long doggone way. Yeah, man. So it's it's a world of difference. You know? This is respectable. Not saying there's anything wrong with this. <laughs> Not saying that at all. 
But man, man, <laughs> y'all feel me? It's just, it just hits differently, you know. Yeah. So, yeah, I love the love, love, love the desert paint job that they did on this. It's just really good. Um, I could always use more M stock. Well, that's that's just to me. This is the iconic stock of the ACR, the Advanced Combat Rifle, which at some point was in gear to be the next Army rifle but failed and now um it's possible that even the spears might be in the same situation but the spears i think are moving faster as the standard you know combat weapon of the army infantry or and just combat arms in general for, for for now we'll see um but yeah this is what could have what if this is this is definitely it you know what i'm saying so Again, let, let's just to drive the point home, right? Let's let's switch it up, you know. So so y'all know, just so y'all know, you see how the brown here just complements the earth tone browns that you got over there. Now, if I was to switch this to stock. I wanted these in tan because at the time I was like, these would look good with my um, 60th anniversary infantry uh, soldiers. But I put it together and I'm like, mm, it looks like a rifle that they would carry. But the paint job or lack thereof was just kind of like, you see what I'm saying, guys? You see what I'm saying? M maybe not. Maybe I'm the one just smoking, you know, something. <laughs> but I definitely, it, it, it to me, it just yeah, okay. You guys want to okay? Let's let's drive the whole the point even further home by by showing you just how different a paint job makes it when when I arm. Our guy Ricondo with it. Now, <laughs> if 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 you if you saw this come with their with their weapons, and you weren't aware of their OG weapons, and you, you know, or or you weren't even aware of Ricondo or who Airborne was, and these are the stock weapons they came up with. You would say that it was congruent with the rest of the line until you know because because that's what Hasbro would probably have sold as far as color is concerned. But you know, yeah, it's it just doesn't have the same. It just doesn't resonate as, you know. So I, I, I just, I had to demo it this way to change it up. So you guys just understand why it is that I gush over the paint job versus what it looks like on the plain tip. It's just the, a, a world of difference in my opinion. The, the, the black magazines already, you know, make it like and the blue uh uh sight scope paint just takes it to a whole other dimension you know what i'm saying you just you, you, you the, the color complements it's just it can't be beat so yeah uh final thoughts on this you guys should get it if you guys are fans of some different and to get it in, you, you know, a paint job fashion. Um, ACRs make more sense to me in the desert fashion because that was the, you know, it came out in an era where desert warfare was a thing. So to me, it makes more sense in desert. But, you know, you're, you guys, are, it's your taste. You guys order the color. Don't forget to use code 
uh, discount code Coco Smooth in the purchase, and of course the link to the description below for the weapon, so you can get you guys can order it yourselves, okay? If you guys want it, but yeah, the, the, I'll have it ready for you guys to. Well, the link down below for you guys if you guys want to check it out. All right, folks, that's all I got for this segment of One Twelve Scale Military Action Figures takes the Advanced Combat Rifle uh, set in desert fashion by our boys over in Top Fun Retro Toys 3D. I am your host, Coco Smooth, the casual collector. And until the next video, folks, ciao.